Hello everyone, please fasten your seatbelts and prepare for landing in Gimiport, Give, Give Report, Chapter 19 of Fire Emblem Engage. As always, you'll be guided towards this landing by me, but also by Raisins. Hey Raisins. Hello, I'm very pleased to serve as your co-pilot today. I guess, I guess like, if we've already made it here, then like, I should be speaking in future tense. We've already served as the co-pilot. Like, you know, everyone's about to disembark from the boat. And <laughs> yeah, I hope at this point this the pilot's done their job, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be your co-pilot today. If we got to I, this I, point, I, yeah. Auto, I, autopilot does some pretty amazing stuff, I guess, right? So. Mm -hmm, for sure. Watch this autopilot. Woo! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Just skip the Wrong port, Lamau. <laughs> <laughs> All right, chapter 19, let's go. I, I looked at the map beforehand. It looks like a more chill map than last chapter. Pretty relaxed map maybe deceivingly so but it doesn't mm. look super intimidating to me right now but it does look interesting let's have a look see a single one a single look just yeah one. just one it's, I back mean, to prep. it's gotta be a short video right so gotta yeah. have one look this is all we get one look per person per viewer i have returned hey uh Zephia. how'd the report to lord sombron go Bet he was mad we lost the rings, huh? Very. <laughs> Knew it! So he's gonna punish us, right? Finally, yes. In fact, no. It was a scolding, nothing more. He impressed upon me the gravity of our role. That's all? <laughs> he must really love us! Feels good to be appreciated. Has Lady Vale woken up yet? No. That spell you keep casting on her. This is getting reckless. We should dispense with the magic for now. Allow her to return to normal. The spell will soon have a more stable effect. Lord Sombron gave me an enchanted helmet. What? For her to wear. A helmet imbued with his power that will amplify the spell I cast on her. Finally, I can erase the defect from existence. I intend to use it shortly. I would like to have some good news for my next meeting with Lord Sombron. Speaking of news, our warships ran into the Divine Dragon's forces. No luck stopping them. Sounds like they're sailing to Illusia as we speak. Huh. Moving faster than I expected. Yeah. Only a matter of time before they're knocking at our door. Oh! Want me to buy us some time? I can do it! Of course, dear. So good of you to volunteer. But I can't have you going all alone. Mavia, you'll accompany her, won't you? Very well. What? Why? I'd be fine on my own. You are good, of course. But you'd achieve even greater success with Mavia at your side. Well... Okay. All the more praise for me then, right? Zephia, I ask one thing. Wait to cast your spell on Vale again until we return. All right, Mavia. Then we depart. We'll be back before you know it. <laughs> I mean, it's not like we can kill them, right? <laughs> nah, it can never happen. It can never happen. Whenever Sombron gave her the helmet, I thought that, like... Hold on. There you go. I, I, when it, whenever she gave her the helmet, I thought that, like, it amplifies the mind control powers of like the caster yeah not of the person wearing it so yeah like, that's what i thought too it's like how's zephyr gonna wear the helmet bro like yeah. you didn't think this one through did you <laughs> no it's supposed to it's like a vr helmet right <laughs> with the spell in it yeah <laughs> uh Mavia. he's way too attached to that other veil truly but it doesn't matter at the moment and won't as long as he stays in his place the four hounds are my family I will always love Mavir. Always. As long as he obeys. Now we have a serious matter to discuss. What Lady Vale said about having a sibling. Right, right. That dragonstone of hers, something about it being whole, not broken. Yes, exactly. We need to look into that. The situation bears... examination. I would love to see the results. Meanwhile, here we are, city. Give report. I expected it to be better defended. We just sailed right in. 
<sighs> What's wrong? This is a port town. It's typically bustling with people. Why is it so quiet? I see someone over there. Maybe they can tell us. Divine One, wait, that's... Oh, hello there. <laughs> one of the corrupted. Yes. And surely not the only one here. You're right. They must have spread through the whole town. Which means... I'm afraid so. Does the Fell Dragon mean to destroy Illusia too? But that makes no sense. All I know is we can't turn a blind eye. We've got to get rid of them. No, we move on. Huh? What? And abandon the people here? Precious Ivy, tell us what you want to do. We leave this place. But there are people in danger. We have a responsibility to help them. That's what we did at Flora, isn't it? We got there right after the attack. There were people to save. Look around. We're too late. Far too late. There aren't any survivors. I would have wished nothing more than to help the people here. But with every passing moment, more lives may be lost elsewhere. We cannot waste our time on the dead. We must protect the living. This is terrible. I don't think I could abandon a town like this, but it's not my decision. You'd already recognize the choice Princess Ivy would make, Divine One? Impressive. Hmm? No, that was... Thank you for your support, Divine One. Now, to the castle. Well, he's like, nah, I didn't even want to save people in the first place. I just wanted to go. I just wanted to run. <laughs> I just wanted a GDFO. Yeah, no, please. Aw, you're going to cut and run just like that. Who's there? It's me, your old pal Marnie. Oh, and Mavier's here too. We meet again. I really wish you'd decided to stay and fight the corrupted. It would have been so much easier. But the divine chicken's afraid of them. <laughs> what, what, what? Isn't that right? The divine dragon was thinking only of what's best for everyone. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just shut up, will ya? You're annoying me. Mm hmm. You guessed right. The port fell a long time ago, but I won't let you just walk away. Wait, how's this for a deal? Drop your emblem rings and you can go. I don't think so. I figured. Worth a shot though, right? Well, time to fight then. And don't worry, we brought lots and lots of the corrupted just for you. Tell me one thing first. Please, I need to know. What? Vale. Is she all right? Lady Vale. She. Shush, Marvier. We didn't come here to blab secrets. Afraid we can't answer that, Divine One. Our lips are sealed. Tell you what, when this is over, I'll whisper it into your dead little ears. How's that? We'd hope to learn whatever we could from the people of this town. But with no one left alive, we're glad to get the truth out of you. One way or another. Mm hmm. Yes, Marnie. Yes. She's so cool. It's time for half of the four hounds. The two hounds. Again. Two hounds. I think they even have the same emblem rings as before, for what I saw. Roy and Micaiah? And Magie? Yeah. yeah. Oh, there you go. Who leaves so yes. permitted us to use emblem rings? Nah, I just went ahead and <laughs> <a couple>. <laughs> <laughs> You did what? Marnie, when this is discovered... I'll be what? Scolded? Punished? Please! We're Lord Sombron's favorites! Besides, if I capture even one more ring, imagine the praise I'll get! I'll be a hero! Even in that case, he will not forgive you. Ugh, skip the lecture, okay? Just put it on! If you ruin my chance to shine, I won't forgive you! All right, all right, all right. All right, let me know my preps. I see a Double lot of miasma. This relationship, yeah. A lot of miasma. <laughs> just a little bit of miasma. Just a little bit. <laughs> just so, so I had like a jar of miasma Fire with them and they just spilled it all over the town. Just... Check uh, it out. Free battle.
they saw some yes they're like well i might as well go all the way like got yeah. the other two jars in their pantry and like yeah. shook those out too it's like that that meme from the from the powerpuff girls it's like a little bit of that a little bit oh whoops mm -hmm. <laughs> spilled all of my miasma is was making the perfect map yes <laughs> They added monsters, uh -huh. enemy formations, side objectives, but then accidentally added. <laughs> this is my wrong save. One second. I loaded the autosave by accident, which apparently is not good enough. Yeah, no, it's. Uh, I think there will be a lot of uh, Zelkoving here in the middle. Because I saw, I saw my party split in three. That's pretty pretty interesting. Uh, this should be the one. This is, yeah, this should be the one. Pre-battle, as opposed to world map and post-battle. Oops. Wait, that'd be weird. I love um, our new unit on the left side of the loading screen, by the way. He looks adorable oh, when Wendy. he's running. Looks so funny. It's probably because he's not really someone you could think of as like likely to run around. <laughs> it's like very athletic. He's just over here jogging with the rest uh -huh. of them, you know? Yeah. So uh, the bunch of Miasma, we got two big corrupted merms standing on either side of the map. Uh, big group in the middle. Not a whole lot on the sides. It's like two... Max Great Knights here, and that's basically it for the bottom side, unless you count the Merm, the Worm himself. And this side only has the Worm right now. There's two villages mm -hmm. to save, one here and one here, which is like in range the start, start first turn if you have high enough movement. Um, of course, there's uh, Mavie and Mikaya standing here, apparently not moving. And if Zelkov gets here, you could probably freeze them all too if he wants to. And then mm -hmm. here's Marnie, uh, again, Roy on her and not too different looking um guess slightly different weapons this time but nothing too special i guess they both have two purple things i think she has one right yeah she has one mavia has two and the other than that is just a bunch of miasma a couple pools and the party is split in three here so uh and there's a recruitable sapphire here which uh, is pretty interesting and i think you talk to her with a leer from what i can see maybe there's someone else who can do it too yeah um, where is she? I'm trying to remember. Him? Maybe his description will tell us. Sapphire from Brodia, right? So maybe uh, Diamant could do it. But I'm not sure if this is where I want Diamant to go because I have him here right now, and I have a way to recruit her. Turn one with a leer that I think is pretty cool anyway that I prepped for. So we should probably just do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And go from there, and um, uh, yeah, everything else I'll go over when we actually have done stuff but i think my turn one is going to be effective and if it's not then you know i'll learn new things let's see what happens yeah, yeah let's, give, let's give it a go yeah here we go i got this cannon too which i think is pretty neat divine one the flame cannons with those you can burn right through that miasma that's pretty cool why the divine dragon dock here the place is infested because I've got no choice but to cut my way through these moldering bastards. Please don't. <laughs> Please stay back. Uh, the dumb thing I'll is Alir's on the deck here and he can't go anywhere. Uh, he can't go and recruit Saphir. Um, but I think mm -hmm. with a repo and a dance, I can make it work. So what I'm thinking about for turn one is to put Alir sex here or here. Repo mm -hmm. him up with uh, Chloe. Dance with Sidol. Talk to Saphir. And then we go from there. And then these guys don't even move, so if we mark them, we can see we can just stay out of range. And all you have to worry about is these two here, and I guess these, but they're further in. So if we put someone like um, Kagetsu in range of them, then I think we'll be golden. So I'm going to try to do that. Yeah, that should be enough. So if we get Saphir turn one. Yeah. Saphir could even be part of the enemy phase. It's part of the reason why I gave Alir a hand axe to give her. Maybe something else as well. <laughs> as opposed to this massive tomahawk she's carrying. Yeah. Well, she has a... Oh, she has a tomahawk. I didn't realize she has a brave axe. Okay, never mind. I should have brought like a, an iron axe or something in that case. Well, you have convoy, so... Yeah. That's probably a way to set it up. So, since Cito can reach either way... Um, just gonna make sure you don't, I don't put him in enemy range. So you go here. I don't think I'm gonna engage etc. yet. Um... Great. Yeah, Ivy's on the other side, so we'll have to use Chloe. That's fine, though. Uh, she can't canter after this, so just Reaper. Get you up here. Get you up Ooh. here. Hello there. Special dance on a Leer. Definitely gonna do a lot of things with that. This turn. With all those stats. <laughs> all those. I mean, let's be real, though. 
after all these dances, he suddenly got some more stats to him. Like he's got 30 oh. speed with the uh, all the things on him. Whoa, true. That's like pretty good. And what is this like 24 magic attack? Yeah, it could be worse, yeah. I guess. The only issue, I guess, is that he's like he's not good at a sword. So, yeah, it's not yeah. good here. It's just sometimes he might be able to like do some damage, right? With like this is yeah, okay, whatever. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Back to the bench you go. <laughs> I have to draw that hyping up, yeah. <laughs> Never mind. Well, if it isn't the divine dragon. I know you. You're that knight I met at Brodia Castle, right? Saphir of the Royal Guard, at your service. Prince Diamon sent word that your ship was headed to Elusia. With the situation at the castle under control, I thought I'd come give you a hand. I'm glad you decided to join us. When Prince Diamond wrote us about the king's death, I felt like I had no choice. It's my duty to protect the kingdom his majesty left behind. Diamant will rule that kingdom, so my life belongs to him and to you. Use it well. All right, all right, welcome here. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, Saphir. Yes, uh, I'll give you this because otherwise I brought it for no reason. Uh, yeah, I can't engage anymore, that's fine. I didn't really care enough, so. I didn't take a whole lot of look at her, but I do like her skill, at least situationally. Like, 20 extra hit and avoid is pretty good. So if you can survive yeah, right. being below half HP, that's probably valuable in some way. And at the very least, it's a new unit I can sub in if someone else is like feeling they're falling off, or Gold Mary or Kagetsu doesn't work out at this point, I can just sub her in and have her have a go. And worst case scenario, this is not a backup unit that I can just put somewhere with a hand axe and get extra chain attacks in. Or use that massive 24 strength to just finish off an enemy, or... Maybe kill one with a Brave Axe. She seems usable at the fair least. Like, usable, not fantastic, but nice to have for now, I think. Have you used her? Yeah, um, I didn't really give her much of a chance, frankly, in my run. So it's kind of hard for me to, like, evaluate. I will say, I, I think her starting inventory is, like, kind of crap. I'm just generally not impressed with Braves in this game in general. Mm -hmm. um, maybe they're better, like, on hard or normal. But, like, on Maddening, they were, it was... Is this six anyway. might I'm seeing? Yeah, six might. Uh, they have enemies have so much protection. It's like I'd, I'd rather just use a silver, even if it means I only hit once. I'd rather just use a silver. <laughs> um, so maybe that was kind of clouding my initial perception of her. Was like I was thinking, oh well, less might than a hand axe. <laughs> yeah, less might than a hand axe. Exactly. Sad. So. Yeah, I could see that. I mean, you could have given her an iron axe. I guess her normal speed mm -hmm. is nineteen. I don't think that's enough to double anything, so we'll see how she does against Time these. Uh, the the Mesma guy is obviously bad, but here she could do a fair amount of damage at least. Wait, these guys are they staff users as well? Interesting. Yeah, they have staffs. These are Royal Knights, which is a class. I don't think we've promoted anyone to Royal Knight, but they're a new uh, hybrid class. They're Mounted Staff and Lance. I see. Yes. Well, what I could do is I could get to here and murder this one guy with my Silver Axe, and then others will come to him and also murder themselves. And mm -hmm. he probably does better than uh, Saphir here, but eh, what I can do, I guess, is it doesn't really matter what Saphir does here. She does she does not contribute anything to this. This is just guy gets to doing good yeah. work. <laughs> I was like, I can chain attack. No, I can like chip. No, it doesn't matter. Oh, here he comes. He's just got it. Mm -hmm. And uh, here you go. I think Leaf gives some arm shield for some extra uh, durability as well. This is helpful too. Oh my goodness! Keep going, Kagetsu. Kagetsu. Yeah, I know. That's how it works, right? He gets weapon triangle advantage now, basically. Whenever yeah. he does have it, he yeah takes five. But golly, that's so good. What? <laughs> yeah, but all these guys have lances, so this will be quite instrumental. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess I'll put you here in case there's a chain attack for you to do next turn. I don't think there will be because Kagetsu is going to murder everything, but he, they might not. And okay. Can see how you don't really do anything here, so I'll just sideline you a little bit. Mm -hmm. This is probably a good square for you. And then, I mean, this group was all about Seedal. Uh, now I just gotta get to that village before... I don't know, there's probably gonna be a bigger bring popping up at some point. I don't know where exactly. Um, the bottom group is Zelkov. They can't really do anything about Miasma, but there's only one enemy here. So, mm. if we could just travel through and maybe yes. throw Gold Mary at him, that'll be good. Yeah, we, we do have the Flame Cannon to, like, clear out Miasma if we want, but oh, yeah, that only one. works, like, so far into the map, right? Let's so. do this! Uh, yeah, I guess I have to be... On it to fire, and it can get mm -hmm. all the way here. But flames obstruct me, right? They do. So, so maybe I just—I don't really care. Then if they are, I mean, 
I guess it sucks if he attacks me, but if I just move Gold Mary in, next turn I can twin strike this guy and he's probably gone. Oh, true, yeah. Uh, I guess, yeah, no, that's a good point. So I don't know if I care about this Miasma more than I care about going through. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm your if it does end up getting end. annoying, I can always use the Flame Cannon anyway. Like, I can I can leave Pondreo a little bit behind mm -hmm. so that he's still in range of the Flame Cannon next turn. One, two. Um, yeah, this is, is the monster in range of Gold Mary next turn even, or no? Uh, well, Gold Mary has six move. So, oh, she does. Yeah. You're totally good. right. Fouling good. I think I didn't really math it out, but it turns out that Gold Mary can exactly reach a monster without them being able to reach her. So that's convenient. That's pretty good. Yeah, Remember pretty that good. for later. Yeah. And over here, um, I'm going to use Zelkov to use Anything. the Fog Machine. It's original, I know, but it also clears out all, clears out all this Miasma and lets us just secure the village next turn for pretty free. Nah. And You've never done this move before, have you? I've never seen this before. <laughs> uh, I think. Okay, they don't have ranged weapons. I thought one of them did, but that's not the case. I would use someone else here, but you need to clear up the Miasma to do anything reasonable to these guys, so this will have to be it. Nice, nice. And Wait, then. Uh, ATA is probably the best person to take care of that worm here, so I'll just use her. Uh, yeah, we need her here anyway. I uh, don't want to put Diamond there because of the Miasma. I think this is not a Miasma tile, so I could, I could put him here. I mean, he's not a race, he... so it doesn't matter. Maybe just like better in the center, or. Mm, it is where a lot of action is happening. Um, it's possible Kagetsu can't do everything on his own, in which case it might be nice to have Diamond up there, so sure, we'll, we'll move him out there. Yeah, maybe it's better for him in the center. No mistakes. Mm -hmm. Just like more firepower in that part of the map. Yeah. And Ivy, if I fly her here, she can still reach the village next turn if I need to, but I can also heal Zelkov, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Oh, what are you? Oh, I didn't check in. Oh, shit, what is happening? He here? has the warp stuff. Oh, no. Who are you warps? Oh, you brought an enemy to Kagetsu. You fool. That is exactly what I wanted. Exactly as planned. What was all the chain attacks, though? What? Uh, he also warped a guy there, too. He warped two people. Oh, wow. Wait, he warped two people at once? Yeah. What? Oh. Guys, Mecha doesn't know. I don't know. I should check things. At the, all. Uh... There might be a problem here. Ooh. Oh. There might be a problem here. Uh, Kagetsu? Oh, Kagetsu? Uh, dodge time. Nice. Yes. All right. Good, good. All right. We might avoid our punishment now. Still a lot more to go, though. Here he comes. I mean, like, we dodged one. That's all we needed, right? Yeah, but uh, it better come soon. Yeah, no. I think no, the, the rest is immobile. Never mind. I think we're good. Mm -hmm. Check 30 XP for a kill, too. God, dude. Yeah, let's go, Kagetsu. Please survive. Dude. It's not like plus three oh. strength, plus three speed from base. Gosh, never yeah. Punished. So, uh, so Mecha, you didn't, you didn't read Makaya Ring. I mean, at one point I read it. I didn't know it was updated so, now. No, Makaya's augment. Uh oh, right. It has an AOE effect now. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So that works on warp stuff. So. Okay, so. He warps people who are adjacent to the warped. Oh. Yes. I see. Warps whoever you get and anyone adjacent. Also I'm gonna check Marvin. I'm gonna check her too now that I've had this near death Hold experience. Hmm, well, this seems familiar still. I mean, I better keep it in mind, but this is not as dangerous as that. Warp staff. Is <laughs> the warp staff? You are very mean right now. Wait, you dropped that or? Yes, droppable brave lines. Okay, good. So these are Mikai's weapons. This is his droppable thing, and he has these. <laughs> it's a rescue, too. <laughs> That's cute. Well, now that Alir is here, and we have the people lined up in a way that is like almost a mirror to the Dance of the Goddess, it would be not. It would be foolish not to consider a Dance of the Goddess here to just trash in here and murder some people. Just get in and like... At the very least, maybe kill the calves next to him, so that if you... Nah, I guess he can only warp one of them. Mm-hmm. I think he's done the most damage that he could with the warp staff. Like I'm, he, he can only warp one person next turn. Oh, that was that was scary to close though. Yeah, uh, oh, his res is really high too. I was thinking like, could we entrap him? But probably not. He's also on my he's asthma. Got... Do we have other ways to clear terrain besides the cannons and the uh, fog machine? The Zelkov uh, obstruct staff is the only other one I know of. Well, you can't use obstruct on his tile because he's on my asthma. <laughs> That's the problem. Mm, yeah. No. How do we how do we flush him out? We need Zelkov. Uh, or I guess a smash weapon mm -hmm. would work. 
but Ooh. you'd have to smash him from the back, which is pretty precarious by as well. Yeah, it's also like full miasma. I guess another alternative is we could just like have 47 attack, right? So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, this is actually, yeah, it gives him, the, it counts the res that he's getting. Uh, I suppose for three. The, the funny That's thing so is, beefy. the best person to lower this defense is also Zelkov. So, oh no. I mean, oh wait, these guys, oh they couldn't reach me because of the fog. That's right, I have to do it again this turn. But I guess once mm. he's like through here, he could just make his way up. So it's not that bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just get put, to do it again. Yeah, just put him here. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Basically, <laughs> put him here. Uh, obstruct him a little further with the fog. Uh, bait these sword masters out as well. Just have Zelkov do a bunch of work here to distract some enemies. But Dance of the Goddess plays probably not super helpful here. But I can set it up for next turn. Let's do yeah, this. Yeah, for next turn it'll probably be fine. Yeah. All right, let's make as much fog as we want. Uh, they don't have range weapons, so they can't do much about this. And now we can visit the fizzles for free. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use Ivy here, I guess, for this. Oh, hello there. Oh, seriously? That pranked. I'm so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they told me know. that there was a bad. <laughs> they did tell they me. I told you that everyone had died. Yeah, I can't even be mad about this. There is an item at least, right? So is there? Yeah. Oh, on the droppable. Yeah. What's that? Oh, I can use that to heal all the damage I take here. You know. What, uh, you, what even, a you even make me send Diamond to the middle, you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, look, you didn't have to move Zelkov first. I'm just saying. <laughs> I guess I didn't because he has passed, but damn. Yeah. I, he wasn't even on the village, yeah. Okay, so I could send him to the middle. Uh, hand axe one of these fool. Or oh, just even kill. Ragnall, maybe, or no? Yeah, I guess if I engage Ragnall, he can kill, and then ATA kills another one, and then. Well, at least we then, have, then like, a speed taker. Yeah, it's it's one guy. Like, what's what's he gonna do? Yeah, let me just check if the Oko Ivy or not. Forty three. No, Ivy survives nope. that stuff. Okay. Uh, Alir doesn't reach. Stupid anti corrupted are all the way up there. Well, it's it's engage in time, I guess. I could be oh, cheap right. and just like try and crystal them back into the village, but whatever. Yeah, come on. That'd be well, lame, what's right? The, what's the joy in that? Let's just, just no deal with joy. our problems. There is no yeah. joy. Alright, so I kill one, then I guess the other one will just attack ATA. Sure, move forward, whatever. Um, I think if I Silver Axe, I die on enemy phase. I wonder if Mini Boat kills. It's scarily close. Oh, you have Alacrity with Silver Axe, don't you? Oh, I do, you're right. I keep forgetting about this for some reason. It's almost like I don't play Skill Emblem all that much. Well, no Desperation Gaming. Right? Yeah, I guess it doesn't matter which I kill, so I'll take this one out. I'm here! Uh, yes, that's my favorite one. Alright. Yeah, yeah. As long as we're like not next to Miasma, I guess. Exactly. Quite fine. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, speaking of which... I guess we'll have to take care of... I don't know, what are these supposed to do? I guess it's just like make it harder for me to move through. Um... What if you just walk past them actually? Hold up. <laughs> yeah, just do nothing about them. <laughs> just bait those two, I suppose. Just I mean, they, the they occupy like an annoying amount of tiles, so it might, might, it might be nice to kill one at least, but... We'll see mm -hmm. how plausible that is. Um, yeah, I keep on rocking that. No damage, Alir. Mm, no other chain attacks here. You can double the Swordmaster with this amount of damage. That is good at least, as you canter backwards. I think we have to do this because doubling and just being a good And perfect damage. Yeah. Well, perfectly overkill, but perfect nonetheless. Oh, I forgot to well, second the... Whoops. Oops. Oops. I I hear that if they're at level 20 and they gain XP, then they get doubled SP for that period of time. Really? Oh, cool. I, I, I don't keep track of the math. I, actually, hold on. No, I was about to say we could go and like do the math real quick, but I don't, I don't feel like working out the XP formula. Today, <laughs> you don't just, feel like you know, it. All right, fair enough. I just... Well, leave it, leave it to one of the people in the comments section yeah. to do the math on her SP uh -huh. before and after. I don't see any status staff, so I'm gonna swap these for a moment and use a mend on Kagetsu from here. Mm -hmm. World tree. Yes, world tree saves a mend use. Oh, does it? That's funny. I forgot about that skill completely. Is that her her class personal thing? Yeah, her class personal. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Mm -hmm. All right, so now it's really gonna get in the way of your plans to use all your physics and prove me wrong, right? So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. 
I don't want them to attack me here, so if I'm going there, I need to canter away afterwards. I've got this. Which none of you can do. Uh, what are you using right now? Who's this? Sure, let's get a kill with her. Why not? There you go. Hear her kill quote. Yeah. I mean, this could have been 30 XP on Kagetsu. You guys should be aware of how much I'm sacrificing for you. No. We just want to have Saphir Gaming. Yeah. Does she even, like, have a quote? I think she just, like, sighed. Did she? <laughs> Seems yeah, in character from what I can see from like, her. Oh. Alright, do we just do the vanilla thing and like dance Chloe and like ride us Bane one of these or something? I guess we can... Because hmm. there's no tile where I can not fight on Miasma, right? Maybe with the Rider's Bane she would still kill? Do we just like dance one of Kagatsu and Chloe and just like have them go back and light the fires or no? Like Hortensia could even do that too. Oh, hmm. Yeah, I guess if we use Hortensia, we don't care that she falls behind. Um, yeah, she's got physics and whatnot, so... Yeah, I suppose if we light the fire, then we can maybe kill him with Kagetsu afterwards, while we'll also bait over another lance uh, with Royal Knight. That's possible. That's Let's see what the fire useful. does to Do we... with. Oh, actually, is Saphir in trouble of dying to, like, a guy if he warps someone ever again, or no? Uh, I guess so. 18, 35... Not really. Yeah, yeah as long as he only warps one person... One. Which I don't think he can do more than one. Yeah, no, he, 35 he can only and 18. do one at a time. Yeah, it looks fine to me. If he does that, that's great. That's just uh, more damage on him next turn. I'll try to mm -hmm. Hortensia play. I like that. Um, Hortensia. Yeah, sure. Here you go, girl. Stay here. Hortensia loves firing cannons at people. It's just what she does. Yeah. Just war crimes everywhere. Oh, this is a pretty massive area of effect, actually. Yeah, uh, get a lot of miasma in one go. Yeah, I'll, I'll want both calves for sure, so I guess this is probably optimal. Mm -hmm. And then Kagetsu doesn't care because he flies, right? So. <laughs> <Just nice. laughs> Big damage. Small Hortensia, like firing a massive siege weapon. Yeah. Like. <laughs> okay, so if he goes on fire, does he care? Uh, he he actually does not is not affected by fire at all. Nice. I think this is the first game where flyers are like completely unaffected by terrain. Like even forts don't heal them. <laughs> Wait, what? Really? That's sad. Yeah, I put them on the fort, and it's like nope, no healing. <laughs> I don't think so. What if this aggro the guys? Well, not right now, I guess. All right, I'll murder some more. Uh, mm -hmm. He takes eight damage. Someone might get warped in his face, but he'll be fine, I'm sure. Yeah, this is fine. a break. One less fall. I think. No, he's not the one that inflicts dodge, that's Selkov. He's just... He has something. It's like... Minus a higher hit. Enemy, I think? Yeah. I think he gets higher hit. Yeah. Basically higher or, hit. Yeah, destroy whatever it is. You, come mm -hmm. on. Just, yeah. <laughs> you get it. You get it. Yeah. Um, you get it. I want to leer like, kind of far so we can maybe against the goddess next turn. But not mm -hmm. too far that he dies, so... Kind of like this, for example. Oh, the shielding, right? There yeah. you go. I haven't used that yet. I've, it's been on him for like 15 times. <laughs> he just <laughs> knows everyone's know? items, man. He just knows everyone's items. I know. It's great. Like, what was it? Last episode, we had the Linden one. Yeah. And it's like, we literally just met him. Yeah. <laughs> it was literally, talk. I think he ended this turn next to Linden after talking to him. And then he's like, oh, you lost this, by the way. So oh, by the way. I'm beginning to yeah. think he just like, he just robs these items off of people and say, hey, you lost this. <laughs> just to gain mm -hmm. favor with people. That's really how he recruits them, right? So. Oh no, I missed her quote. Better than ever. Oh, quote. sorry. <laughs> All right, I gave her <laughs> some uh, some bond points with Erica. So oh. I have stronger. <laughs> I have Just a slightly yeah, stronger okay. Siglin. <laughs> it's a little bit better. A little bit. Uh, yeah, we didn't need to for this guy, to be honest. <laughs> Could done yeah. without it. Even this kills somehow. I guess this gives her one to range, but nothing is here yet anyway. I can't no. Realize. And that puts her in position to get that village too. Yeah. You get you get more enemies on the field, you mean? Oh, yeah, yeah. Why do we repeat our mistakes? I kind of want to see some Siglent gaming. <laughs> Get some more enemies on the field? Why do we repeat our mistakes? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> uh, Marin can fight these two sorties. I think actually not. Yeah, you can. You can. You can. Uh, if we go in the tile below Gold Mary. Uh, 24 and 19 defense. 38 attack, so 19 damage. Doesn't kill, unfortunately. But if we'll make it to the next turn, we can go Marin for one and then Gold Mary the other one. I don't know if she kills, but maybe with Marin's dual strikes, we can get something done here. 
Mm-hmm. We could get a crit too, you know. Like yeah, that, there's that could there's a lot of ways for this to work, and even if I don't kill them all, I guess I don't see a reason to have to fire a cannon now. So I'll just move Pangeo in as well. And he can probably finish one off too. Offensive Pangeo, ready for duty. Fire damage. Oh, here comes another one. Oh, bleh. whoa, whoa, whoa! Have you ever seen that? <laughs> you sound I've like you didn't see that before. That. <laughs> That's so I've good. I've never seen that. Okay, but two can play that game. Wait, where are okay, you going? Um, what is yeah, what's he doing? That is hilarious. Uh, we're gonna be okay. I don't know. I mean, Marnie moves, I guess. But is she gonna move? Because I'm not that close to them. And like Marnie was with like some armors, I think. I said this was a chill chapter, but it's actually kind of funky now. Yeah, no. What just happened? Like Soviet Illusion, Map Warp skips you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is true. Wait, what just happened? Oh, he's on the Miasma. What? Oh, he. this was one of the guys he rescued from Marnie, I think. But... Oh, I cleared... Did I clear the Miasma with fire and then he took it? And then that... Oh, God. But that might block the tile from him being attacked further because he's so low on health. He can't really afford that. Yeah, no. So I think it's just a new a new enemy. Like, it's a great knight. Oh, that's nice crit. Very cool. Wait, is this fog? Huh? Is that Miasma under the fog? What? I'm confused. He's doing like no damage. No, that's just a great knight. Oh, okay. I'm. You said about the last guy too. I guess I just don't pay attention to class types. It's yeah. okay. So this is partially my fault because I don't pay enough attention. But I will say that especially when enemies are corrupted, they look awfully similar sometimes when they're similar classes. Yeah, fair. You kind of have to like look at the weapon type and just. I guess no. Mm -hmm. Like it's pretty obvious when a royal knight is a royal knight because they like have the lances and the oh sometimes the stabs, right? I can't get over this. Uh, Mafia moves now for some reason. Oh, interesting. Oh, he moves now. What? Yeah. Uh, Rod. <laughs> um. Ah, not that fast. Not that fast. There are ways oh, out true. here. What if? And this is hypothetical. Mm -hmm. What if we rescue Staff Zelkov up here, and he froze them all with Torrential Roar? Oh. Hmm. That's pretty good. Do Although, we have a way... Hmm. We have to make sure he survives, because there's a lot of people here, and if he was in the wrong spot... like He needs Torrential Roar to hit Marnie and Mavier both. You get Torrential Roar from, like, one northwest of Movier. However, if he, like... If he attacks Marnie, which is ambitious... But if he attacks Marnie, that freezes like a hundred million of them, right? So yeah, that would freeze everything around Marnie, uh, but not the two other people here, right? So mm -hmm. maybe we attack Marnie, dance him with like Dance of the Goddess or Seedal somehow, and then we torrential roar this whole group. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, wait, I think if you torrential roar, can he can he hit that swordfighter from the south in melee? Oh wait, no way, just right? Like that? Oh, so close, yeah. Ivy. Yes. I could, I could repo. But the problem is there's like 5,000 enemies here that will murder Ivy. Yeah. So we have to I win this like, turn. <laughs> we could maybe call the doubles, but even that's like kind of dubious, right? Like, because after four of them go down, then Ivy dies. Uh-huh. Well, I mm. mean, we also have Override here for like a bunch of damage on those guys. I feel like... I really do wonder if we have Dance of the Goddess here and like Seedal... Mm -hmm. You gotta wonder if you can at least immobilize them all. Ideally, we kill them all, but I don't think we can get enough damage True. on them all. Yeah. But Seeka Zelkov does so much debuffs on them that I want to try it. Do you want to try it? I mean, kind of. Marnie only has a you know a meager sixty defense, right? So well, we're gonna take away the terrain, right? With torrential roar. Oh, true. No way. Yes. At least we'd have to torrential roar here, and then. Probably attack Marnie again. Mm -hmm. No, actually, if we don't do need to, if we're going for it, south, if, hmm. yeah, if we turn to roar from the south, we still have to deal with Mavier's plus twenty defense. That might be too much. Uh, so that's why I'm thinking we have to rescue Staff Zelkov up here with like Hortensia or yeah, it kind of has to be Hortensia. No one else is up here. There's like five health bars here, I guess. Honestly, we okay. Here's what we could do: we could freeze a lot of them, and then if we have the torrential roar on Mavier, if we just get Mavier. Then like we're kind of fine, right? Because 
all of the guys are frozen. Right now, if they're frozen, they're still, like, kind of the wild card of Movier. Could just, like, warp Marnie next to someone and, like, is she mm -hmm. really frozen, you know? Yeah, <laughs> yeah <true. laughs> Yeah, I suppose killing... Yeah, actually, I didn't think of him warping people from here. Uh, he does have a does warp left. Still have any? Okay. Yeah. The, the use his rescue staff was one use, I guess? Yeah, I guess so. I think I saw that, yeah. Uh, the and, thing is, though, if we go for a, a, a play where they, where Marnie survives and Mavia does not, we do have to worry about these guys. Or rather, if we Torrential Roar, we have to worry about the Swordmaster, I guess is my point. Yeah, just the hero. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it's a hero. You're right. There's a... I mean, we have, like, ETA with Astral Storm, right? Like, True. could that do anything or no? Well, because... She has 53 attack with that gun. Yeah, it's, it's quite insane. I say we try... Let's try to get Zelkov up in here without using our Dance of the Goddess. That would be my main objective, really. Do you think that's mm -hmm. possible? Because he's quite far away, and Alina needs to get a pull from the combat, but we kind of need uh, Hortensia to help with it, too. Because she's the only stack user up here. Chloe Maybe... cannot cast Rescue, can she? Chloe, I mean, what what rank is the Rescue? It's we in can... the convoy. I don't have, have it here. Hold up. We can peek in combo without Let's sending the turn. Let's see. Uh, well, we'll never the, know. Uh... Be, yeah. No, it's fine. What we can do is we can have Hortensia pulled out and just get it and then we have seed all dancer and canter forward a little bit and oh, then we have yeah, to yeah, use totally it. it and then we haven't used our dance of the goddess we can use it closer to here have cool. someone like getsu chloe we have like we need to pick who to dance to as well but i think we start with this and then based on where seed is we figure out where dance of the goddess goes what else is hortensia going to do probably like physic kagetsu or we can physic kagetsu we can silence or freeze mafia or marnie mm -hmm. yo wait could we no, we, there's no way we can freeze the Swordmaster down there from over there. Wait, what about Fortify, actually? Uh, I can cast Fortify. I think it's uh, Saphir, too, for what it's worth. Yeah, uh, is that worth the Fortify used to heal, heal, heal her? <laughs> to heal, I mean, like... Uh, if I could reach with Freeze, I would definitely do it instead. Or with, uh, yeah, she's a little too far away. Sure, I'll use Fortify, whatever. Here you go. It's, like, way less HP than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, it's not a much... Yeah, um, maybe Physic was better, I apologize. <laughs> physic is not going to do much either, I think. It's, they're pretty weak in general. Okay, so uh, this is like his max move anyway, so this feels like, if we're going to do this, this is pretty much how it has to be. Mm -hmm. God, the plays you can make in this game are insane sometimes. Okay, so this is all free floor that we can use for our Dance of the Goddess uh, here. This works out pretty well. Uh, mm -hmm. Even We have you know, like a two-range attack here on Malvia already with, well, I guess Chloe if she engages is an option. Could get to... <laughs> Kegasu probably dies, right? Oh, he doesn't have a range attack even on him. He well, he has a tome on him right now. Movier does. Yeah. Um, Forty-one attack. Uh, HP. Oh, he barely dies. Well, if, if we use physic, he probably would live. Yeah. Hmm. Sorry about that. That was my it's bad. Okay. But... What I can do is override with Chloe and encounter here or here even, and that mm. is an extra slot we can use. Uh, Hortensia is probably going to go here. Oh, we need to get Selkov in as well. Does something actually need to be done about this Great Knight too, or no? Yeah. Um, well, Bring that's what on. she's for, right? At this point? Not not the Royal Knight, the Great Knight. Oh. The Royal uh, Knight doesn't move. Oh, yeah, this guy doesn't the, move. You're right. Yeah, the Great Knight is the Axe guy here next to uh, Kagetsu. Yeah, I see him. Let's see. 30. Uh, What the hell? Oh, he's, is he on Miasma? He's, he's just both? No. Okay. It's just how much he's got. Yeah. yeah. I suppose... Hortensia, maybe? I don't know. No, Hortensia needs to Wait, rescue hold on. Wait, does Marin have Cantor? Marin, yes. Marin could be part of this, right? Yeah, Marin can't reach anything else anyway, so we can like, have her attack first, I guess. Maybe, yeah, maybe we can get Gold some Mary has... afterwards, yeah. Like, Gold Mary has Siglund even, so she's like got that whole north side like dealt with. Yeah, I mean, she can run away, worst case scenario anyway. Um, mm -hmm. so you're going here, I guess. I, mean, I guess here is a little better. Or, actually, yeah, the other time was providing, like, chain attack to Movir if we ever care about that, but... Well, we're gonna... I think we need to tell for Zelkov first. That's why I did that. Oh, true, yeah, I yeah. Think. Uh, let's get Zelkov over here, because I actually don't know how wide the range is here. Uh, no, don't do that. Oh, we just get him, nice. Okay, come here. Mm -hmm. Hey, we saved the rescue use, let's go. Hey! <laughs> okay. Let's go World Tree. So we need to. Uh, he doesn't have Cantor. 
And I want, I want him in a dance, right? To I guess we can attack Mafia, dance him, we? and then Torrential Roar? Hmm. Do we actually, like, care about having him in the dance, or is, like, this just enough? Well, if like, I guess there is the Swordmaster, but... Yeah, I will ignore the Swordmaster for a second, because, like, Zelkov is never going to be the best part of that solution anyway. Like, I guess... Yeah, no. Yeah, you could freeze the Swordmaster in some way if we did, like, Torrential Roar here and then dance him. But we can't do that, so... Because we need the Torrential Roar from right next to this formation anyway. They need, like, you can either Torrential Roar from here or from here. But we Just have to be here we... afterwards, right? Just pretend you have a freeze stuff. Yeah, she does. She could just try that on the guy, maybe. I yeah, I suppose so. I mean, if we're not dancing Zelkov, then like I guess Chloe is what we were dancing then. Probably. Yeah, Chloe's probably better anyway. Let's do Chloe. Let's engage, override, etc. Mm -hmm. Maybe Let's actually we before we do it, maybe we should use Vel Zelkov first to uh, apply the hex. Yes. But I it needs agree. to be not in the way of the override. Uh, maybe the override is like not. A big deal. Like, okay, that uh, this like torrential war applying terrain on everybody and like getting rid of their miasma and applying draconic hex on everybody, I think is like way more important than an override, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I think so. So, too. like, we always have next turn for an over for override if we desire. Uh, yeah, I suppose so. So we might even want to have Chloe just like attack Movier this turn even. Yeah, like, she just does have the Bane normally, right? And, like, even though he's a stalwart, it might be good. So I guess just transfer roll from here and then dance for... For Kagetsu? Question mark? I guess what we can do is apply the transfer roar, have Chloe attack normally, mm -hmm. and then put her in a dance. Basically. That's probably the best play. That's true. Okay, yeah. Alright. Uh... No, 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 don't do that. But don't get in fog. Uh, engage. Yeah, no. The time has come. I mean, yes. it would take away Miasma, but <laughs> yeah, also well. get in fog. <laughs> Here goes no, nothing. Thanks. Wait, is this going to work with the zero damage? Yes. Okay. It should. Just waste no time. I must return to Lady Vale. I've got a lot riding on this, so do me a favor and die quick. All right. Okay, I'm excited I've for this play. My Nice. Okay, did it target them both with the thing? Yeah, everyone except the Swordmaster's Frozen. Yeah, are they also all and... hexed or not? Oh, all three of them are hexed, yeah. Yeah, these three are hexed, right? Not just the people who are in the water, basically. Yeah, just yeah. people in the water. Golly, it's so freaking good. Holy crap. Yeah, it's so nice. Look at how much they're... He just, they just lost a combined, like, 80 defense, basically. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see how much damage Chloe can do now. Uh, let's try Movier, because, like, that's what we're going for. Um, oh she has freaking one rounds. Yeah. Okay, so Kill Lance is with a crit is a kill. Rider's Bane is almost a kill. Yo, what if we... Uh, hmm... Okay, if we had like one chain attack, we'd be able to get a kill here somehow. Mm, but time crystal back and put Marin in position. Well, like because when we cantered Marin, we could have gone west or we could have gone south, and that's just the south for the chain attack. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I didn't. I don't think I needed. I thought I might need a square because the point is, uh, if I were to put Marin there. Like, oh, I can still counter that Sally. I think you're right. I think you're right. Yeah, I think I could do that. Let's see when, when it was. That was like five years ago. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so Sea Dolls Dance. Uh, so what did Baron do? She like went for the Great Knight and then cantered. Yes. Yeah, attack and cantered and then mm. we rescued with Hortensia. No, lies. No, lies, better. lies, lies. I'm going to engage with her too. Oh. And she changed attacks from everywhere anyway. Because I didn't know for sure at this point that we would go for these uh, nuts. Uh, yeah, dagger's probably better. Yeah, it doesn't matter. This guy is uh, not very instrumental right now. Yeah, as long as we just do something, right? We just need to die at some point. Okay, so we go here now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Let's go for that. And then it was Hortensia pulls up Selkov. That's right. We got to save the world tree RN, right? Oh, right. <laughs> I wonder if it will still be there. It should be. Yep. Yes. <laughs> save the tree. Alright, Zelkov does the thing. They they say their lines. Uh, engage. Emblem engage. 
Torrential Roar. Mafia talks. Marnie talks. There's the thing. Everyone gets... Okay, this is too satisfying to skip. Yeah, now we gotta see this. <laughs> pew, 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 pew. Pew, pew. And now Chloe goes right through him. Uh, I think this guy needs to die first or something? No, we have to engage her, that's right. Yeah. I mean, he probably will die at some point, but... Alright, so it's normal, everyday, right, Spain. Will be your kill, yeah. We do gotta Happens hit this. Every time we do gotta hit this. Oh, true. I guess... I can... just hit it. Yeah, I just... Easy. Momentum! Yo, what if Momentum only killed because that guy was in the way? Honestly, I think it did. <laughs> Forgive me, Emblem. I know this imposes a burden upon you. Uh oh. Alright, what you got now? Because I didn't I didn't realize you would get stronger. He's, he's that thing increased, right? He's just got Yes, yeah, silence word. Fanny, Fanny? Ooh, okay. You need to silence whatever. What if you silence him first though? <laughs> I think I did that and he he was still silenced. <laughs> that range plus five here. Okay, this is what he already had. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, it doesn't look too different. I think you had shine equipped already, and like it doesn't matter what else you can use if he's never going to be able to use it, right? So, all right, Alir, gonna do your little dance. Emblem engage. We even have a seed all now too. Oh golly, that's so powerful. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. It's like maybe we can get rid of Marnie. Just kill them all this turn. It'd be tight, Hold, but mm. but like with Seedal there, chance exists. I'm okay. trying to like what if Chloe do the math now? What if it? Chloe crits uh, one of them? That'd be a kill for sure. I mean, Chloe just has a kill on Movier already, right? So well, I guess. I mean, you need to chain attack again, but yeah. Yeah, unless sure. her attack is like able to kill Marnie, then. Well, Marnie has like a million defense, right? So probably not. Probably not. Yeah. Um, is that like her actually... actual defense? What the hell? Why is she so bulky? Oh, I guess the Ooh. emblem helps. She does have holdout too. Yeah. So. I just thought of that too. Hmm. Yeah, Marnie yeah, might be a bridge too maybe. far, but getting rid of Mafia alone is like a pretty big accomplishment. We can we can instead of going for Marnie, which we probably won't do, we could just get rid of the hero instead, for example. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Ooh, we could actually Dan Zelkov and then go in like fog machine next to the hero. And yeah, sure, that doesn't like guarantee it, but it blocks so much of his terrain that like what's he gonna do? You know? Fog machine next to the hero? Oh. Hmm. Yeah, like from right there. Well, like it blocks so much of his move. Well we could also like just hit this guy, for example. That'd do the same thing, right? Or just hit the sword master from range with Zelkov. Because mm -hmm. Fog Machine will give them Fog, right? I guess it clears some Miasma out, but... Yeah, I, I was also thinking that it like, clears some Miasma. Like, but, missing them, I don't think is that bad, but them hitting us and doing damage is, like, pretty tragic, right? Yeah, well, the reason is, like, because the Miasma is only enemies that we don't care about anyway, right? So, mm -hmm. do we really care there's about also, it? There's also one other thing is, uh, we haven't really seen, but there's a Wolf Knight to the south. With, like, actually pretty tremendous range right now. Oh, uh, you're right. People so, if we... Yeah, that might be If a we thing. fog machine, if we fog machine with Zelkov like next to that Swordmaster, then like look, look where the fog's gonna be and look where the water is. Like it's just a huge yeah. wall, basically. That's probably true. Um, but if we dance for Zelkov, then how do we get rid of Mavier's other health bar? Because we still got two. I guess uh, Marin we... plus. I mean, Chloe gets one, right? Like that's already been established. As long yeah, as we Chloe, gets, Chloe one. gets one. Marin almost gets the other one. What else have we got Can... left? Like Kagetsu <laughs> with a range attack, I guess? Yeah. Marin doesn't have Noble Rapier, but well, actually, if we dance for Zelkov, the square opens up for Kagetsu. Uh, true. Oh, these people look so alike, I swear. Yeah, I suppose yeah. Kagetsu can just get there with a one range attack then. Sure, these guys don't have range attacks. You could probably just quad hit, honestly. That might work. Uh, nah, come on, get out of here. Oh, that's true. Sure. Okay, we do have those beans. Maybe we save the quad hit for Marnie. If we can. Just Maybe so. Yeah. Okay, let's... So I guess we just do Chloe now, and then mm -hmm. uh, dance for Zelkov, I guess. True. So, oh, something does have to be done about this Great Knight at some point. But, like, we have Convoy here, too. He could, like, grab a hammer, even, I think. Oh, yeah, we can have... Um... We got Sapphire, too. It might have to be Hortensia or something. 
this guy, right? Uh, that's actually pretty good, frankly. Yeah, that's not bad. Uh, Gold Mary can't help with it, so... It mm -hmm. might just have to be Hortensia plus uh, Sapphire. Actually, yeah, no, Hortensia plus Sapphire works totally. Alright, let's, let's see. You don't die to this, right? That's fine, okay. Let's try this then. Wait, do you actually do any damage with this? Okay, there you go. There we go, much better. Mm hmm. Nice chain attack. Saving the day. I mean, it like helped because we missed. But, uh huh. You know. uh, I guess Hortensia wants to be a little closer to the action in case we need to like do some chip damage with her. More Hortensia kills? Possible. I didn't think I would do it either, but here we are. Just waiting for a better Hortensia to come along. Hasn't happened yet. It's never gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> Please let me have this. Uh, okay, so okay. I guess we'll do the big health bar with Chloe. I'm assuming he's probably gonna get another power after this, right? From this, so maybe we do the Zelkov thing first. Ooh. I don't know. Maybe if we poison with Zelkov, we don't need the dual strike to hit. That's just all the copium I'm come I'm come up with right now. Yeah, I think Zelkov's play was already like accounted for though, right? Probably. Um, so Zelkov is here. I, the engaged people look so alike. It's kind of annoying. Um, yeah, I've just been going by the portraits, but even the portraits is like blue hair lord. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who <right>. that? <laughs> So with the Great Nightgown, we can put Seedle anywhere we want, so that's fine. Mm -hmm. Chloe... Alright, let's hit another chain attack, I guess. It's gotta hit. Yeah, I suppose if this misses, we need another backup attack. But it looks like we're fine on that. This, love is a crime. this, this woman is a crime, she's too good. Alright, just go chill out here somewhere. Looks like a good spot. Okay, so Zelkov is going uh, Fog Machine here, right? Yes, I think it like needs to be here. Uh huh. So if you Fog here, I guess the Swordmaster is like a fairly limited move. I hope it's like yeah, not too much. Okay, that's that's he perfectly fine. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. What about the Wolf Knight? What's he got? That was the other like big if. Yeah, he's fine. Nah, okay, that's. Now you know too. from last turn he does like no hit on Zelkov, so he's fine there too. Uh, so Marin into Kagetsu on this guy, I guess. True. I guess it first, maybe. Well, maybe, Ooh, maybe not. Maybe on. not. So maybe not. Could get to first. <laughs> maybe, Could... maybe Marin first. Oh, true. Yeah, Marin first. Marin does a just... massive amount of damage. Don't worry about her. Uh, in fact, she needs to be healed afterwards. Well, Thirteen but, hit though. I mean, oh, she might not need. But we have Ivy as a backup here. Oh, she can't mm -hmm. reach that with uh, anything. Well, I guess just Oops. just dodge and then figure out another way if he, if she does get hit somehow. Just dodge them now, yeah. Yeah, just dodge the 13. The 13 real hit. 13 true. Nice. The RNG did not lie to us today. Uh -huh. Alright, another poison layer 2. Uh, do we just leave her here? I guess so. It's like, like a we could... pretty good spot for her. Ooh, I see what you mean. She has no ranged attacks, unfortunately, so... Can't but, like, we're still providing dual strike to her. Yeah, I guess moving on forward is fine. Because this will guarantee her dual strikes, right? The problem oh, is wait, wait. we need to square for Kagetsu. No. Yeah, we need to square for Kagetsu. Yeah, never mind. Yeah. This is best. We need okay. to do some Kagetsu used to here. Because uh, otherwise he has to be like on Miasma next to uh, an enemy. It's not a little sus. Fine. little sussy. Alright, uh, Kagetsu. I guess you're getting another level up here. Cutting in. I have like 40 experience. I feel like half of this map has been this turn, but holy god. But it yeah. Now. <laughs> HP, strength, stack, speed. Call on it. <laughs> nice. Thanks. I appreciate it. Oh, nice. That might come in handy too. Maybe not this turn, but at some point, I'm sure five speed will be handy. Um, well, like I said, mm. these two kill two enemies. Should be fine, right? You can go, you can one round kill, right? Right? How's your How's your Siglin do versus Miasma actually? Because Siglin is corrupted, effective, right? Yeah, but uh, not effective enough apparently. Also, she just mm. takes some massive damage in, in return, so maybe just let him come to her. Uh, Andreo doesn't get doubled by these guys, so... Hmm. She can't just, like, kill the south one with Sigland, and then... Yeah, I guess it's, it's either her or Pandreo. Um, if Pandreo does it, either way they can end up on Miasma. Neither of them has Canter. And there's always Miasma somewhere. Where, wherever you attack this guy, there's going to be Miasma, right? So I guess just have... From, from the west, hit, there's... I guess, so that Well, he, like, from... Yeah? 
from... From us, there's no Miasma, because we block off that southern one. Ah, uh, you're correct. I thought I was smart, but here you are, being smarter. Good old corner strats. Ah, it happens. Maybe there's something Pongeo can do now, with his turn, that's, like, useful. Mm, I, I physics, forgot if he's yeah, a physic. I don't know. Yeah. Physic Wait, Gold Mary good? Yeah, Gold Mary good, apparently. Alright. I don't really care if Pongeo gets attacked, because, like I said, he survives. We can pick up this thing here. Uh, I guess I can fortify here to heal, but that doesn't seem worth, so... I'll just vibe here with my Thunder Tome. Yeah, we're not hitting Sapphire, so it's not worth, right? <laughs> and... Oh, this, these still exist, that's right. This whole team is still here. Uh, they actually maybe don't want to be here, though. Oh, we still it's have like Astral kind of Storm, too. Uh, Ooh. Let's, let's, maybe we save it for some hit on Marty. Because, like, what is it going to do this turn? Like, kill... Go in here to kill more enemies? That like, doesn't seem too productive. Yeah, no. Like... And we've got... Does this Wolf Knight have one range or two range? The Wolf Knight. The Wolf Knight you just marked. That looks like two one range. Two. Ugh. Yeah, it's not great. We the fog machine was really keeping this team alive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess Diamant is here. Uh, we could move him forward. He's probably not going to die to a bunch of physical enemies. And then next turn, yeah, he can like... help out over there. Probably not. I think this team doesn't matter at all anymore. Uh, let's not forget to visit this village next turn with uh, Gold Mary, by the way. Hmm. True. True. Just uh, see some more corrupted. I guess we have to kill this guy for his item. So Where's the boys here? Yeah. So I guess it's like hang back here and kill, because then they can't really reach, I think. Like he has six move, which is I think all displayed here. One, two, three, four, five, six. So if ATA like goes here, kills this guy, and everyone else goes back a little bit, it should be fine. I think so. Maybe even Diamond forward if you want to. Not a big deal if we don't. And hopefully risky. <laughs> Looks like I broke him. Hopefully AT has to move to do a useful Astral Storm next turn, but I think it's like 20 range, right? So it should be good enough. Uh, yeah, 10 range on Warrior, but... Oh yeah, it's no longer a covered unit. I'll put Diamond in here for some funnies, like Great Ether, I don't know. Great Ether, Great Ether... Ragnall? Great Ether Ragnall seems best, yeah. Look guys, he doesn't counter. He's, he's bait. Don't, no, no. All right, let's see it in action. What's happening here? Oh, right, that's fine. <laughs> that's just XP. No SP for that? What? Oh, she doesn't have a oh, ring, she, that's right. Yeah, she doesn't have a ring. Uh, oh, Silkov? Right. Oh. <laughs> nah, it's Silkov, remember. <laughs> nice try, nice try, guys. The, the pair up is really just what finished this build off to be like completely invincible. <laughs> Nobody kills him. Yeah. I think, did they not see that the pair up does no damage? I guess. I mean, maybe they poison him still if they hit him. Now they need to. You need to do. Oh damage. yeah, you need to do damage. That's right. That doesn't only work against me. Sometimes it works in my favor too. Guess I, did it I know on hard enemies just don't attack if they do nothing. But different circumstances, of course. Oh my God, <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> Goodbye. Square has it's been opened. Over. Beforehand, we had to find the tile to put them on. Yeah. Should bring our own, though. Yeah. Portable. Portable pocket dust. Pocket sand. I put some fog in your eye. Alright, here goes the Diamond. Go. An attempt has been made. No way. Did you zero? <laughs> I still think. That's if a yeah. Silver Axe! He, he's not even in Resolve range! <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, though, I think if he wasn't using Great Ether, he would still like take very little damage, and he would like counter-attack counter one-run one run kill. Right, please, battery, last through this. Please. I don't want to have to grab my USB cable. He'd probably do more without Great Ether, to be honest. I think so, too, but this is epic Great Ether. <laughs> okay, dude. Oh, we got it with the Reforge? Oh, no. What is Reforge again? That's a it's the Royal Knight skill where oh nice level. If that's only at 18 defense personal golly bro. Um Reforge is a it's a Royal Knight skill where if an adjacent ally gets broken and the Royal Knight has 10 HP oh, yeah. or 11 or more, then it just the Royal Knight loses 10 and just unbreaks the ally. That's cute. All right, uh Marnie, it's your turn to uh go down. I think there's still some hex applying from last turn, but it's wearing off one by turn, but there's still 
so Quite much, ancient, really. So much on her. Uh, I guess Zilkov and uh, Marin first, just to uh, mm -hmm. get it done. Uh, Marin's here. Zilkov is not a backup unit, so I guess we use Marin first. Do oh. we rally first, though, or no? Oh, that is actually a good play. I mean, we already danced the goddess, so we might as well. Uh, I guess if we do it from. We could do Pandreo or Kagetsu. Everyone else gets hit regardless. I feel like. Mm -hmm. Pandreo is more important. Actually, this is Marin. Uh, the most There's... important units are Chloe and Marin, I think, so maybe mm -hmm. just do it here. There's no way we can. Um... Use like Sea Doll or any of these units to get this village up north, right? Because I just realized if we have Gold Mary visit, we still need a player phase action to kill whoever holds the item. Uh, the item is. Oh, the villager, right. I guess if someone kills this guy, then Andreo could do it. Let's why don't, see. Why don't we see what the item where, is? Where is the item? Yeah. What is the item and where what is, is the it? item? Yeah. I'll do you one better. Why is the item? Why is the item? Maybe there is no item. Who is the item? Oh, <laughs> the miasma tile? Forget about Dracoshi. it, bro. Ooh, that's kind of good. <laughs> that's kind of uh, good. But the miasma tile? Uh, that's kind of disgusting. Game, why? Obstruct staff? <laughs> on his tile? Well, yeah, on staff? that tile, and then visit. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I think Pantero has one. Yeah, okay, oh, alright. No. Oh, no. Alright, alright, we're me. doing it. Short video incoming. And then we gotta figure out how to get the village too. Alright. Well... We got a few people to second seal now. We could do it the other way around, where we figure out how to kill Marnie first, then we have like 100% kill lined up on her, then we can figure out what we have to do with the rest of the units. True, it's only two health bars anyway, right? So, yeah. I'll put it's four actions at least, because hold out. Mm. Yeah, it might be tight, but I mean, worst case scenario, we can always give it to Draco Shield. It's not that big a deal. It's just two defense for the unlocks. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> uh, let's see. Do quad, quad hit? I think gets around it. How much does quad hit do right now? Like, I know, I know, it's kind of lofty, but like, imagine, right? It's gotta be some rallies here too, and some uh, some other buffs. Uh, Let's just forget I ever brought this up. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Promise they're like all physical and her defense is still 37. I guess it's going to be lowered a yeah. little bit, but uh, yeah, no. How is it that bad though? Because like with the Kinder Axe, it shouldn't be that bad. Like it's oh, 42 it's... with this and 37 with that. How do you do zero? You seem a Lance Reaper. Interesting. Well. Anyhow. Yeah, in any case. In any case. How much does this do? Uh, nothing. What if you just attack without any fancy shenanigans? Okay, that's, that, that she's looks getting, like damage. Well, this is... She's getting fairy tale. That's all her personal. <laughs> so. Oh, wait. What do you mean? Uh, no, Chloe's personal. Oh. It's like with the, it's within a nine square around her, right? Yeah. Uh, she has Kagetsu and Marin apparently, or you know, yeah. in a fairy tale romance in her mind. So mm -hmm. I'm just gonna like throw knives at her first, and we'll go from there. Yeah, just like rally and throw knives, I guess. Yeah. Oh yeah, rally first is probably good. Um, I think we were figuring out from where to do it, and then we got it caught it into where do you do the village thing. Yeah. We just Maybe gotta we make just... sure we hit Chloe and. Uh, those guys. Do it from I, south of Kagetsu, maybe? Yeah, that's actually the best square. I don't know why I didn't think of that one. That's actually by far the best square to do it on. Like, why? Oh, thank you. This is luck percent, right? He's getting it every time. <laughs> every time? What's Every yeah. time. Except when you don't remember that it's there. True. Um, Marin can go from Lake Street, but she needs to occupy a square anyway to get the dual strike, so I guess it doesn't really matter where mm -hmm. she goes. To do, like, from next to Lyra and then canter to north, or...? For the personal. Um, uh, sure. Seems good to me. Uh, dagger. No counterattack. Thank you. <laughs> nice. It's actually, like, gonna be harder than I thought. She's got, like, a lot of stats. Um... Uh, it'll go down. It'll go down. It'll go down smooth. There's no way... There's no way Hortensia can do it, right? <laughs> I think... Didn't we kill her with Hortensia last time? I think so. <laughs> It's like a fair bit, actually. This is some damage. But we gotta play around the holdout, right? Yeah. 
Well, maybe we can play around the holdout with uh, with this when it actually is like fully powered up, like it wasn't before. Like this is her real power. Yeah, there we go. That's the yeah, damage. That's, that's the stuff. Way. That's way different. What is her actual <laughs> big damage attack gonna be? Like, I don't think we have one. <laughs> we need some more magic up in here, or like a hammer this or something. Do we have like a weapon sword for Chloe or something? I don't know. Oh, but she can't even use it because she's not sword. Yeah, Ugh. she's not in the sword class. Andreo? Yeah, that's might be a problem. Yeah. I mean, she if can't we open up because we're doing this, so... Do we have like a stronger tome than this? Stronger tome than a dagger? No, no than, the, than the dagger, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, let's go. It's a good start. It's going somewhere. Plus we're reapplying Draconic Hex as well. Which is oh, like true. plus one damage on everything. I mean like, tome's stronger than the one plus two. Mm -hmm. That's what I was thinking. You still oh, hold on, Astro Storm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I see it too. Probably gotta be closer. Maybe, we might be like one square off just from eyeing it up here. Are we there? Ooh, we got it. Are we there? And this ignores holdout question mark? That is a good question. I think it says round of combat, right? So probably not. Yeah, hmm. Well, I mean, we could still get her in range and then kill with Kagetsu at least. He doesn't do much damage, so. Yeah, we could even do like Pendreo to finish off this one too. <laughs> with the thunder. Yeah, Wait, with is the Pendreo our most like, damaging unit against her? If we have like a normal tome. Whoa, hold on. This doesn't double, but that's because it's, you know, thunder. Uh, he has like 22 speed. Maybe he can get our next health bar. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, that's like a lot of damage. Uh, is there someone who can like get a tome to him? Hortensia has From... a wind plus two. An Ivy what about has... like convoy? one in convoy? If like if we have Kagetsu leave the square, what if Kagetsu like goes here to finish off after the Astral Storm, and Pandreo goes mm -hmm. here and gets a tome from Convoy? That's pretty good, yeah. That's, that's I don't a, know what's in Convoy. It'll think, be a mystery tome. The best tomes are usually out on the field. So, Wait, we got a Bogonon? But yeah, I mean it's kind of heavy, isn't it? Eleven. Probably still double with it though. I think that might be the strongest yes. tome we have. Okay, want to try the Bogonon? I guess. Yeah, sure. Okay, so let's that's Astro Storm, Bolganon, see what happens. Astro Storm, and then, you know what I mean, right? Yeah, quadruple hit, why not? Just see the animation. <laughs> quadruple cringe. Yeah. I mean, it killed a, it killed a Wyvern pretty good last map, right? So, yeah. You know. now I have you, you. Or a Berserker, or whatever it was. This is still the same turn, by the way. <laughs> well, <laughs> this is still the same battle, I should say. It's a different turn, but it's part of the same maneuver. Okay. Oh, so we did yo, that. Have, have Devon killed a monster? <laughs> and then what? I don't know. Just, just for fun. <laughs> just for fun. <laughs> sure. Is he have some Let's kind see. of? Oh, he's pretty strong. Do uh, you have a way to like Oko him, or is this gonna be it? I think this is gonna be it. I right, can go for a crit, I guess. For funnies. Just for funnies, yeah. Just for good luck. There we go. Yeah. We'll no and me. SP. Oh, very nice. I was about to say for XP, but then I realized he's capped. Yeah, I got a second system of people. Alright, Kagetsu. It's all down to you. I suppose if Pandera does a lot of damage, we can always dance him with Cedal afterwards, too. Oh, whoa, yeah, you're right. Anyway, uh, no quadruple hit needed, apparently. Hmm, I cry. <laughs> no hit needed, apparently. <laughs> Kagetsu wins by doing absolutely nothing. Alright, <laughs> what, what, what are we doing here? I'll show you we mean business. Emblem Roy! All right. Uh, did you get the binding blade? She just got the binding blade. The binding. Bl oh. Um. Good. Forty-four. Pendreo needs to heal. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Hortensia is gonna have to heal Pendreo, and then Pendreo needs to like kill in three hits or something, because otherwise this is gonna be very weird. Yeah, this is like plus a lot of defense actually. Maybe Pendreo is gonna have to end up doing it first, but. Then we still... Yeah, because this kill... I guess he also decreased her, increased her defense, and this was barely a kill, so maybe changing the order around with one help. But let's see what, if we can do it from here. Because mm -hmm. Alir's right here. We can just grab it from the convoy and see what we do all those tomes. I'll give him the win, too, in case that's somehow a better option. Yeah. I don't think it will be. It has the... Well, it has the, uh, like, Lucina engrave on it, so it has a lot of um, mend, mend, mend. We need that, too, right? Oh, right. Oops. I thought I had to recover on him. Uh, yep. Okay, we're, we're pulsing. Because this yeah. is not going to heal enough, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, Fortify is not enough. Whoop! Whoops. Get the mend. 
Uh, yeah, but the wind has the Lucina emblem on it, right? So, so pretty sure that gives like plus thirty avoid. So you, you're saying you can dodge is what you're saying? Yeah, this is with wind. I mean, we can just line it up, right? Uh -huh. like, this is gonna get check special dance, I guess. And does that increase magic though, right? Damn, so strong. Well, one percent though. Yeah, one percent hit Lamau. Let's look at the ball and see how much it does. Because it probably isn't the better. Oh, you can't use it. Shit. Well, that's, that, that solves that problem. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, yeah. Guess we're using wind plus two. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because all these are range. I guess elf fire might be stronger as well. We'll take that. Mm -hmm. Sure. Let's see what we do here then. Uh, probably going to be wind plus two into elf fire or something, right? Mm -hmm. Or maybe elf fire first. We do need that. Uh... She has to end up below. What is it? Like Twenty percent. 30%? I forgot it what, might be, what her first honestly, pull she has. It might be 2 at this point. She might have got it upgraded. Well, 2%? No, like, like 2. Like 2 HP. 2 HP? Yeah, there's... I'll just use Elfire, see what happens. Yeah, we still have pulses, it. it's fine. Um, I can't believe Pondrea was about to clutch it. Of all people, yeah. Ugh. All I know is he can't take a counterattack anymore because he got hit just now, so... Mm -hmm. If he has to, like, just hit her twice but dodge a hit, we might have to do something like switch time for Divine Pulse, try to dodge the, with the wind, and then go from here. Divine Dragon. Yeah. So let me see what that skill is before we see the results. So hold up, plus plus, 10% or more HP. Okay. That is the case, unfortunately. So... She's just living with one, I guess? I guess we could use wind. Does Chloe do like a non-zero amount of damage with override? Yeah, that was gonna be my next question too. Uh, yeah. I see some damage, so I guess Chloe finished it with override. I guess so. Just dodge with wind. Yeah, just dodge with the wind. Sure. Time to dodge. Just zero hit anyway. Hit. Cutting in. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Pandreo. God, is that all our actions basically? That's so cool. Oh. Go. Except Sapphire. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, I was like, if Sapphire was one square closer, she could have done it, and then we use Chloe yeah. to get the item from the villager. <laughs> 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 but it looks like that won't be happening today. Uh, yeah, there's not much I can do there. Okay, let's just see if this Chloe maneuver will get us the dub, because I'm pretty sure over I can kill, right? Yeah, I can. Uh, yeah, it should be able to. Do something strong. Tear thing. Yeah. I think I see Dead Marnie on my screen. I think so. She's got like three poison on her, right? So that's yeah. three damage for sure. Oh, right. It's after defense. You're right. Let's go. See if it does three. This is bad. Damn. God, this Almost this entire battle one. was like the boss battle, basically. Yeah. Let's go. Four Not turns. Two. Four turns. Pretty good. Yeah. Very short, too. One took us one and a half hour, basically. Yeah, uh, no. Just a quick, you know, 22 minutes per turn. Mm hmm. You know, standard draft emblem pace. Mm. Whew. Rings. That was good. They took the rings. Marty, we must retreat now. I can't go back. I'm just gonna get an earful from Lord Sombron. Or worse, Sophia. And after all your nonsense about being exempt from scolding. Now, let's hurry to Lady Vale. Wait, tell me. Is Vale all right? Dude, shut up about Vale. Who cares? Lord Sombron has given Zephia a new kind of magic to use on Lady Vale. If she does, the true Lady Vale will never awaken again. <sighs> The others think this is a happy outcome, but I... I have always worried for her safety. You really do want to protect her, don't you? I have said too much. Marnie, I am returning now, with or without you. You can't just leave me... Hey, wait up! Kill her, please kill her, please. <sighs> is it a good idea to just let them go? We took back the rings. <laughs> Besides... I have a feeling that Vale is going to need him right at her side. And kill Marnie. 
Please. Just, like, pick her up and throw her in the water. She's got a lot of armor on. Emblem Micaiah. Emblem Roy. Glad to finally have you back with us. I never lost faith that we would return to you. Thank you. On the shadowy moor and at Flora Port, it pained me to fight against you. I'm sorry for putting you through that. I promise to never let that happen again. I can't believe there are so many of the corrupted in Illusia. The fell dragon is behind the rise of the corrupted in this kingdom. Sovereign blood is no longer enough for him. He's abducting the people of Illusia. When Sombron drains them, they turn into the corrupted. That's why they're everywhere. You mean the corrupted we killed were. <sighs> Solm, Brodia, Firene. They'll all suffer if the corrupted leave my kingdom. We must act now. If any of my people still remain, I must do all I can to save them. Those two came all the way here to stop us from reaching Illusia Castle. The four hounds must be desperate to keep us at bay. Let's find out why. Wooey! Nice. Let's see if there's some war you after castle. I pick up the poop. I know chapter 20 is another epic thing that I'm going to go into blindly. Just telling you right now while we're waiting on loader screen. Okay. It's uh, something I'm not prepping for. I think a blind reaction might be in order. Let's see. Uh, do you want to you wanna, you wanna talk? Want to say something? Right. Okay, cool. I, I too am glad that we got like five damage in with uh, Saphir. Yeah, no, I, I, hey, come on. She did more than that. She, she, um, she saved Kagetsu basically when you think about it. Oh, true, actually, because uh, one guy went for her. Mm -hmm. no. Could have gone for Kagetsu. Speaking of hey, Kagetsu. hey, yes, I'm very impressed. Thank you, Kagetsu. Actually, yes, very impressed. Your boss. Ingots. All of those. Yeah, I got Gold Mary and could get some new weapons too, so that's why I'm pretty desperate for ingots right now. Give me those. I'm running out of cash. Yeah, cash I'm downloading the, the DLC or whatever. That's like 20 silver and 30k. <laughs> True. Also adds extra HP. I didn't get it. I plan to keep this playthrough DLC free for anyone who's wondering. Um, we're recording mm -hmm. this on the day after Nintendo Direct and like the DLC Wave 2 got released, as well as the version 1.2 update, I think, where you can like build supports between people. It's kind of yeah, nice. Yeah, the... I haven't, I've used it's the support building, but other than that, I haven't really done anything with the new update. Used it. It's like kind of cool, but you mm -hmm. know. Yes. But yeah. All right. We got the poop. Let's get out of here. To the Somnial. To Somnial. Gotta greet my dog. I suppose there will also be some uh, some paralogs opening up, though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if we get to Somnial and then Somni just like catches up to us and lies over dead, then yeah, it's, it's our queue. We've gone on for too long. Mm -hmm. What I might do is play Chapter Twenty and then go back to paralogs. Uh, let's mm -hmm. see what's going on here. Uh, cool. Okay, I'll get the support later. I've been doing those off screen for anyone who didn't notice. Uh, no extra story here. Let me check the world map for the paralogs, because I'm assuming they opened up. But I'm not going to play them right away. I'll wait one chapter. Just want to take a look at them, right? Mm hmm. T take a guess at which maps they are. Yeah, exactly. That's chapter 20, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. Oh, where do you think you're going? Okay. Interesting. That's a paralog, all right. Okay, skip Arino Dats. So I'm assuming this is chapter 20, and this is. Mm -hmm. Oh, Frozen Fortress. Oh, that's so probably 313, I'm assuming. Yeah, you got it, 313. <laughs> and then the other one, the bottom left somewhere. Parallax at the bottom right. Binding Grounds. A uh, place of significance. I think I remember people saying this is chapter 21 with the, all the wyverns, or considering what it's called, it's probably the Shrine of Seals, though. Hmm. I'm thinking. Like the one with, uh... Wait, which one are you thinking? Which one are you thinking? I think the Shrine of Seals chapter. So that's 21 okay. with Murdoch. Yeah, 21 with Murdoch. Pretty yeah. good guess, pretty good guess. Yeah, but um, if I had to make a second guess... Th this is my this is my actual guess, but my, my second guess would be 21X, because that's also... That's just where it promotes... So it's also a pretty important chapter for him. Oh, true. Unless, when, and, um, who's it? Milady died. 
then chapter 21 is where you promote. Yes, but that doesn't happen because maybe it's invincible, but you're right. Yes, <laughs> technically. The game data does support that. People have gone into the code and figured out that that is what happens if you let Milady die. But fortunately, That's no what one happens. does that. If Milady somehow hits zero HP, right? So. See, the more likely way for that to happen is uh, if you forget to recruit Zeus. <laughs> oh, yeah, that one too. I always forget these things because, you know, Zeus is my hyper carry at that point, don't you know? <laughs> Fair enough. Well, okay, so next chapter we're playing Elusia Castle. Is, it, is that the second time we're going to Elusia Castle? I think it is, right? I think first time we just went to Destinia Cathedral, so oh, maybe not. Oh, true. Yeah, okay, so this is new then. Okay, good. I wouldn't have minded either way as long as it's a new map. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Lucia Castle is the next one. Um, and we'll see you for the next one. See you next time.